Hi everyone. So in this video, let's see how we can add files and start uh, start working with our repository. The last video we initialized the repo, but still we do not have any files in our repository. Let's create our first file. Now, now I have my first file. Let's see how is my repository doing. Whether he knows about this file, whether he is tracking the changes to this file or not. In order to check that one, we can type git status. Now, git has understood, okay. There is a one file in the in repository in my directory. So directory is my repository. In there, there is one file, but Git understand there is a file, but Git is not tracking any files. Okay. So first we have to when in the very first time we have to in, uh, tell Git you need to track changes to this particular file. How we can do that is by putting this particular file into our staging area. So when you start working with Git, there are three areas, working area, staging area and commit, commit stage. Okay. So when currently at the moment we are working in the working area and anything uh, that come first time when you put something into the working area in our directory, Git does not track but git understand there's new something new that it that it does not track so file one is something new that git does not track so first time we have to tell git okay track our file one to do that one the command we use is git add we can give the file name or we if you want to uh, let git know you you need to uh, track everything we can use either dot or star. I have seen in some distribution, some OSS star does not work, but you can use either of this method that that is uh, working for you because everything is accepted. So in my case, I just need to tell not all, but to tell file one. So I'm going to use git file one, git add file one. Now if I type git status you can see there it says new file changes to be committed new file file one and it's in green color so anything in green color that means it's in the staging area so i have told you there are three areas git works in, in logically there are three areas working area staging area and once everything is done we push it into commit area so now this particular file is in staging area that's why it's in uh, green and let's say we want to edit file one okay. i'm going to edit file one and add some content now if i type git status Apart from the uh, changes to be committed that's within the staging area, it now identified the file which is which my staging area has been committed all changes also because it's now a file which is tracked by the git because in the first time we told it's using you need to track it. Okay. So understand about this one by normally if you when you create a file for the first time git does not track we have to first tell git to track it how you can do it you can do it by git add then the uh, file name you want to uh, tell git to track or maybe if you want to want you can give star or dot then from that point onwards git will start tracking the changes to the file okay so then we need to tell git to save this status of the file okay 
so everything in the git in order to say uh, in order to preserve a change to a file inside the git so that we can go back and forth as we needed we have to commit it to the git so how you can commit is by using git commit if you type git commit just like this it will open up a edit git editor and let you give a commit message the commit message is tells another person who view the history of the git history of the repository we are, you are, which you are working on to see what has happened with this uh, particular uh, git commit so the git commit should be visible like uh, clear and not like not too short also not too uh, like lengthy should not be a paragraph so in my case i am going to tell added my new file in the repo then i'm going to save the editor and now you can see it's been committed successfully added new file the repo commit commit has been created if there's an error it will give an error in here so let's a deep dive and meet on the next video regarding other concepts.